explain this a little more because I have been receiving questions from people about the Akashic Records. More and more people are waking up, are realizing that there is all this information about them, about their soul that they uh, can get, that they have access to. And most people, I think, first would want to receive a reading and go in hypnosis later. But there are also people that really want to experience it for themselves instead of receiving information from somebody else. Now, you guys know that I do Akashic Records reading uh, readings, but I also do hypnosis sessions with the people that I work with in my mentorship. And I have started to kind of change the way I do these hypnosis sessions, I've noticed, because um, I'm noticing that it's starting to turn more into this guided Akashic Records journey, where I kind of do with them what I do on my own, so that I take them with me into their Akashic Records while they are in a state of hypnosis. And that we can really go to specific moments that I can see are important to them, or that they feel that there is a block about, then I will really go to these moments and we can be there together to look at them together, compared to where I read your Akashic records, then I give you the information um, after. So those are the two main differences. And I am also thinking about offering these Akashic records, journeys, or hypnosis sessions outside of my mentorship. If you're interested, if this is something that you think would be really helpful for you right now, um, send me a message and let me know what you are curious about, what you would like to see in hypnosis. And uh, yeah, we can get very creative and the subconscious mind has all the answers. So let me know. And also, if you have any other questions about past lives, Akashic Records, um, cosmic beings, angels, whatever, just let me know. Bye.